her grandfather, her grandfather's father, her grandfather's father, all the way back up to Hamilton Brown. Hey, how about Why you give that Nan to Candace Owens and she'll give you a hundred thousand dollars? She said that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not I know kidding. her background very kidding. well. I know her background very kidding. well. She said anyone so, who can map out her lineage, she'll give them a hundred thousand dollars. So maybe you should go talk. Like about the, the the stories that everybody is saying about her background is one thousand percent true. She comes from a communist and Marxist family. This cannot be refuted. Okay. This cannot be refuted. The only reason why she has a brown hue to her skin is because they, her, her ancestors was mixing with Hindu women, not an African woman, not a, a Jamaican African woman. And Jamaican does not mean black. So could you cite that somewhere? Like, could you cite these sources to where I could like read it and make sure it's accredited and vetted? You said, can I cite the sources? Correct. Well, you said they, it can't be refuted, they, so... Listen, 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 listen. Kamala has, has gone above and beyond to keep her background hidden from the general public. But if you dig deep enough, you'll find out who she really is. But she so, has definitely gone up. She's definitely taken the steps and the measures. Dude, I don't like Kamala, but her, that argument is horrible. To, so to yeah, can you say the source? Like, I, 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 I like the just say so story. Like, just believe me, bro. But like, can you give me something I can read? I mean, why can't I mean, you yeah. cite the source on the candidate that you're supporting yourself? I mean, I mean, I mean why I do we know? Can you know you know you know know you know I can you know send you. I can send you material. The burden of proof is not upon me. You guys made these claims. No, it's not. You guys made these claims. So cite your source. If you can't, then be quiet. It's pretty simple. We don't care about Kamala. Then why you keep bringing her up? You're listen. The title is about her. So then, who cares about her? The, qu the question the title. We're having a you conversation. The only one that won't talk about you keep wanting to talk about her. But Isn't the, that question, you? the question is literally right, what did you join the panel for if you don't want to talk about the topic? Yeah, exactly. Well, why why haven't you seen her father her entire campaign? Maybe side of source. That's all I'm asking. No, I'm asking you a question. Why have not you seen Donald Harris her entire campaign? Why haven't I seen Melania at any of, of Trump's uh rallies? He was she was at the dinner the other night. Shut up. Talking I haven't seen her. Why, I, I, why, I why have not you seen, seen one person seen from the Harris, Harris family her entire seen. campaign? Wait, I thought I she seen. was raised by a single mom. Wasn't Ooh. she? That's what she, she says. Ooh. That's what she yeah, said. You ain't no mama. That means she's been raised by a single mom. Yeah. She wasn't. Yeah. Oh, she yeah. wasn't. Donald Harris 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 if these things are matter of fact, then nobody should have a problem citing it. Okay, so let's let's just move. Let's just say she becomes a liar. Okay, she lied about her background. Okay, Trump's a liar. She's a liar. Woo! They're both liars. Now mm. what? <laughs> Listen, comparing Trump saying they're eating dogs, okay, mm -hmm. because that's that's because Is that's that what the you think he's lied about. Oh, that's right. Right. Hold on, that's that's what y'all just quoted. But oh, well, I'm just one of the many. I'm just comparing that to a person changing their entire identity, allegedly. So that, that's not a, it's, not, it's, not, it's not a it's not an it's not an alleged I thing. I can bro. prove to you that Trump said they're eating dogs. You can't prove to me what you're saying about Kamala. I can prove to you. I, I can't send you a website link, but I got material that I can send to your email or whatever, whatever. Candace and I, get your money, my guy. <laughs> you understand I'm, what I'm saying? I'm not it's not, on, it's not, it's not, not like kidding. it's not like <laughs> something old. you can www dot. No, well, but, if, but if but if you but if you dig deep into the family, into the into the Iris Finnegan family, and mm -hmm. into the Harris family. It'll take you back to Brownstown, which is her ancestor is Hamilton Brown, who was a slave owner who owned almost 1,200 slaves in Jamaica. This is a fact. This is a fact. Her family comes from England Mason. Do What's your name? Bro. I'm gonna tell. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna email yes. Candy. Hey, if you're breaking you. news on the Anton Daniels podcast, and that's wonderful. But no, I'm this so is not I'm breaking news. Spend... Kamala swore uh, in. Yeah, yeah you're right. Indian. You're right. She hails from African descent. You're right. I'm not. She swore into just... office as an Indian woman. <laughs> you're right. Way bro. before she started running for president, <laughs> vice president. Right, bro. Yeah. She was a senator. The people was in the slave trade. You're right, bro. You're right. Now she's black. You're right. Because it's convenient. Her people was in the slave trade. This is right. the thing, though, it, Molly. You can't be you can't be upset about what's convenient when you want to dodge conversation when it's convenient for you. You don't want to talk oh, about. Trump I'm not and running the wall. as I, the now president. you're interrupting. I'm not running I'm for president. You I'm not question. running to be our president. Molly. It's not about me. It, it, you it, are about it, to Molly. vote for Molly. a complete a liar. Give me you a don't know. You don't even know the woman that y'all are supporting. Y'all don't know her. You don't. Y'all are fighting for her so hard because she's a woman of color. That's the question. One second. Did she, did, did, Not did she, from what did, she did and her political background. Not for what she did 
when she anything she did before she was even running for office. Y'all have nothing to did she not, about. Did she not falsely did convict Kamala. Jamal True Love? Yes or no? What you say, brother? Did she not falsely convict Jamal True Love and hide the evidence of his to, to, to free him from the trial? Yes or no? I have to look into it. Look into. We don't it. know anything about her. Look into it. It's, it's, that's, that's public knowledge. knowledge. That's public exactly. knowledge. Jamal, Jamal, Jamal True Love, Jamal True Love right. sued her for thirteen point two million dollars, and he won the case oh, because she locked him up, uh, sentenced him to prison for life, and hid the DNA evidence that would have freed him of his freedom. The only right. reason why he got out of prison was because his family took it to the news station and it, and it forced her to present the DNA evidence to the judge, and that's how he got his freedom. I don't Go trust look it nobody up. from Baltimore. Well, how long ago was this? How long ago was this? <laughs> this was recent. You, you go to you go look it up right now. You said Does he went. Matter, wait, 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 wait. Does it matter how long ago it was? No, it's just. Listen, I don't know hey, too much about. I'm politics. not from Baltimore, bro. I'm, I'm from Ghana. I don't. I don't know too much about politics, but it's like Trump's a liar, Kamala's a liar, but we're like so. Why, why are we talking about Trump? If the subject at the bottom says Kamala Harris, please. You're, you're, you're right. Hey, guilty here. Guilty here, too. We're always talking about Kamala's a liar, liar, liar. But guess what? Trump's a liar, too. So what else? Like, not, what wait, 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 wait. You just did it again. I said, why are we talking about Kamala? I mean, why are we talking about Trump? If the so, bottom, me coming in as a person that's just observing, sees mm -hmm. that the subject at the bottom, at the bottom says Kamala Harris, why is it that anytime anybody holds her accountable or we have a conversation about her, the default is to say, well, he does it. Too. What are we in third grade? No, I just don't understand these conversations regarding or pinpointing. She's a liar. He's a liar. He's this. He's this. She's this. It's like, I think they're both regarding criminals, honestly. Well, <laughs> but, but again, we still going back to y'all still not answering the question. Why is the question, it? it came when we were talking about Kamala and I made my statement about how I felt like she was being disingenuous in her comment when she was in the pool pit. And then I think, is it Troy? I can't see my... Trey. 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 Sorry, Trey. And then Trey, he mentioned that, you know, Trump is a liar. And so, like, you know, what would be probably the difference in that? So it sounds like <laughs> instead of actually... Kamala just comes around to be... So it sounds like instead of actually addressing the subject... Trey chose to do what every other Democrat does on a regular basis, which is to bring something that has nothing to do with what we're talking about as far as holding one person accountable. You know, when I was coming up and I would get in trouble, my parents taught us to stop focusing on what everybody else is doing. Because if I say, well, everybody else should skip class, that doesn't absolve me from being responsible. And, and I have to address what we're talking about. And so it, we have to address what we're talking about. Just be, your case is not going to be any stronger because you're saying, "Well, what about him too?" That's a completely separate conversation. Even with my, even with my wife, like if we having a conversation, and she say, "Well, what about?" Well, if you felt that way, then we, then you should have brought that up before I brought up what you're doing. We're gonna focus on you right now. So the question is, or I guess. I'm not sure what the question is because there's no question mark. I got a question. The For fact that I'm not, do you all feel like she's a genuine person? I personally think that she's a chameleon. I don't. Most people knows that she's a chameleon, and we don't give ourselves enough credit for being able to spot when we see it. Another thing is, is it's absolutely disrespectful for her to go up on a pulpit in the black church, which is one of the reasons why people are walking away from the church in the first place, it's disrespectful for these pastors to be having political candidates in their pulpits in the first place. I respect their, their opinion on who they're voting for and what they're voting for, but to, to leverage the pulpit of God to ultimately advocate for a candidate, I don't care what, that, what your connection is, that is a sacred place especially for a woman like that that walked in a pride parade, especially for a woman like that that just did what she did. And I almost think that it was planned um, for her to go on that pulpit and to do it as a indirect response to what she did at that rally when she silenced them, the people that said that Jesus is Lord. And so, again, I don't trust her. I think that she a chameleon. I don't trust a lot of people. I can disagree with somebody 
but still find common ground on something that we agree with that's in the best interest of everybody. I don't trust her at all. Me neither. Bro. Because any person that just blatantly disrespects the very core thing that I really, that I stand on, I can't rock with them. I just can't. And I think those are like all valid points. And I think the thing where I get lost here is if you think Kamala is a chameleon, I'm fine with that. But I think the bigger point is that politicians are chameleons. So that's why I think your point oh, yeah. becomes, I think that's where your point becomes sort of moot. It when doesn't. Molly's going to bring up, oh, what happened with the border, this, this, and this? Well, who preceded these issues at the border? Why don't you want to talk about that? So would you assess the same blame to the guy that said, I'm going to build a wall and Mexico's going to pay for it and then never does it? But it's really convenient to say, oh, no, I don't want to talk about that. Who said that? We can talk about it. Oh, no, Molly, just, said, Molly said we can't talk about listen, it. Listen, listen, listen. First of all, Molly is her own person. You talking to me. Okay, but no, I'm talking to Molly, Molly. Molly can defend herself. She's just No, fine. she chose not to. Why are you still talking about Molly? You talking to me? Because you jumped into our conversation. No, I jumped onto my panel to discuss what subject I did. Into the conversation about. to where you had to ask what was going on. No, I didn't. I was asking why y'all would keep talking about something that's not at the bottom of the screen. Because you didn't understand the conversation. That's all no, I'm saying. I understand it. I just wanted to show you rhetorically why y'all disingenuous and can have, having these conversations about Kamala Harris when you are supposed or, or having this conversation about Trump when he's not even at the bottom of the screen as far as the subject that we're talking about. Trump is when, you never when you substantiate your argument, substantiate it based off of what you know, not what you're proposing that other people include into it that has nothing to do with what we're talking about. I agree. And that's why I ask people on the panel to cite their sources. No, we're not going to cite no sources. This is this is not yeah, a thing. Listen, listen, listen. We just going to have a straight up conversation. Ain't nobody about to be going through and cite no sources. We know we know enough about this to be able to have a genuine conversation without you trying to filibuster and tell people to go and cite their sources. It's not necessary. You're doing the majority of the talking. You're telling me that I'm filibustering. Absolutely. I'm doing the majority okay. of the talking. Okay. Can I, just, can I just you doing a majority. You doing a majority of the responding. I need to say so, so you doing a majority of the responding, and then you trying to include Molly into it because you can't stand on it by yourself. But what I'm asking you is, why don't you address the issues that she's because she's been in in the in the White House for the last three and a half years, and so the question then becomes. Why don't you hold her account? Is there anything that you've ever held her accountable for? Or are you just going to keep simping out for? It? It's not simping out. This is a thing. This is an A versus B conversation. This is an echo chamber where you continue to just focus on Kamala. If you if want to have an echo chamber, then you wouldn't be here. It's look at 90% of the people watching this are. If it was an echo, well, stop watching the chat and, and focus on the conversation. If it's an echo well, chamber, to, to, you to wouldn't be, be here. Tanisha wouldn't be here. And, and, well, and a lot well, of let's other just say this to be people. clear Q sent out a, a little thing on Instagram asking for Kamala people. So, oh, yeah, no, 100%. Not, no, 100%. They're, they're the ones no, not Quentin. showing up. No, Quentin, you're you're right. focus no. on everybody else, substantiate your own argument. Listen, I don't care where I go. I don't, I just came from hostile territory and I, I saw my own. I saw. So I don't care where I go. I don't pay attention to the chat. I, I I stand on what I believe in. So forget the echo chamber. Just stand on what you believe in. Is it anything in particular that you don't like about her? Or do you support everything that she does? Uh, No, I don't support everything that she does. So what don't you like about her? I probably not on board with fracking. Well, I don't know. She flip-flopped both times. So we don't know where she stand on the issue. Well, there you go. I answered your question. I told you I'm. You don't probably, like the fact that she flip flop, or you don't like her position on fracking. Her position on fracking that she is what willing is her to position on fracking, fracking. That she is down to frack. That she is willing to frack. Today she is. Yesterday she wasn't. Which Correct. substantiates my argument. We don't know who the fuck she is and what she stand on on no issue. Well, you literally just proved my point. No, you. Yes, your point yes, was yes, that wasn't your point. Was, that wasn't your point. Yes, the, yes, point it was is. to that ask me what original, did I disagree with her on. Original I point I disagree with is her that on. she's fake. And she shifts according to whatever it is that she thinks that people want to hear. On a CNN panel, she said that she was against fracking. Then today, because she's trying to win Pennsylvania, she said that she's okay with fracking. Who is this woman that you support? It, this is I guess this is the thing. Do Anton, do politicians not shift and move in, in talking points? No, 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 no. Don't move, don't move the goalposts. Because it's inconvenient. 
right. Kamala Harris is the one right. that's running for president of the United States of America. The not, not, she's America. not running against herself. The question is, the question is, mm -hmm. do you like her? And then why don't you hold her accountable for the very thing that you just said that she do wrong? Your initial question was, what is something you don't that even I know disagree what she said. with? Your initial question was, what is something that I disagree with? I told you fracking. I answered your question. Now, if you want to move the goalpost, then we can do that. But the, it's not moving the goalpost. It we actually don't know where is. She, we don't know where she stands on the issue. Because no, we do know where she stands because she we said, don't. Did, what was her most recent statement? Oh, we're going about just the most recent one. So we don't include the past two? Is that, is that all I'm asking? But, but, but Anton, you, you you're not it. even sitting in your own theory because oh. the, you're not sitting in your own theory. I don't understand how you don't understand that if there are two people running for this position, why can't you compare the two when these general questions are being asked? Why can't you do that? In a, like, think about the court of law when, when paralegals have to use research to be able to relate it to something so if they have done identical things with different responses why can't they be compared you never bring up anything about trump when it's under the same conversation we're talking about christianity y'all never answer the question on why y'all cool with him creating a book the bible with trump on it if you're a true christian and and you believe in Christianity? Why is that okay for him to do that? I didn't say that it was. I disagree. I'm not. I'm not. I'm okay. No, I, no, no, let's let's get to it. Know, okay, so now I, I disagree with that thing that he did. Now what? Thank you. I want to hear that. I never get to hear. What that does that have to do with holding? Because it on. makes a point that there are different viewpoints based on these on these candidates. No, the it, it makes a here, point that. It Kamala shows that y'all are not objective. We can't enough. bring up the same situation that Trump has done that she's done, but y'all only look at what she's how she reacted to. No, it. you just asked the question. To... I admitted that I don't agree with that. And here's the beautiful part about it: I don't agree with 100 percent of anything that anybody says, including him. But I agree with the majority of what he stands on. Here's the difference between you and I: is that y'all are so y'all are y'all inability to be objective. And you're caping so hard. And I don't even think that, that y'all even like her like that. I think that y'all dislike Trump so much that y'all cape so hard for her that y'all not even able to be objective when you obviously see that she's doing wrong shit, that she obviously a chameleon, that she obviously flip flop on issues. We don't have to agree on everything on a, on a political candidate, but most people can't even justify why they like her without mentioning Trump, which shows you that they don't really like her. They just don't want to vote for him. That's the difference. Mm. When I vote for Trump, it ain't because I don't like Kamala. It's because I think that Trump represents the best interests of America. When y'all vote for Kamala, most of the people that say that they vote for Kamala is saying that they don't want to vote for Trump. But how can you make that That's statement when he wants on. to get rid of the Constitution? Oh, so what, what are we talking about, bro? You, that, you, you right. Wanna, I, well, I don't I, understand I, how I you can vote for a person that question, really doesn't care about you. I asked the question and you're moving the goalposts again. We're so, not, it's always we're moving the goalposts. Do you like her or do you not like Trump? Trump? Do you, you like never want to hold him accountable. Here's my question. <laughs> Here's my question. Here's my question. Since y'all just keep on with Trump, 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 Trump. Trump. Oh, yeah. Here's my question. I thought you come wanted on, a debate, come Antoine. On, come no, on. here's my question. This is a debate. Here's my question. Do you like her or do you dislike Trump? I like her. Why? Why? Because of everything that she has done thus far in, in representing who she is as a woman, <laughs> her background, yes, where she hey, graduated. Wait, wait, wait. Stop at the first point. What has she done to represent herself as, represent herself as a woman? Again, like I said, she speaks truth to power. She stands on her platform. I am big on uh, women's rights. She's big on women's rights. That's important. That's something what, I relate to. You haven't I keep told telling us what she's that. done. You're That's something like that she's done. Like that, she's going around and she's um, having conversations and she's she's doing the work to make sure that we can preserve the, women's rights. In the 40 something years she's been a politician, what has she done? Give me the. Boom, 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 boom. Y'all do this stuff all the time. 
You yeah, you're not sure. Dance is nothing. Dance is nothing. She's done nothing. All the time. Yes, she has. Everything y'all telling He's me is theory. She likes pink. She senator. likes the color red. She 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 no, wears yellow on Tuesday. Made, you're not told me nothing that this woman has done. You love if you did the research like you told us. Um, if you go back and look at the research, she mm -hmm. wasn't handling that case. She didn't handle Jamal Trulove. I'll call Jamal Trulove on the phone right now. Please do it. Please do, do it. Because she like didn't handle that case. Google, Google will help you. What you want to put on it? Do you feel like she's genuine in her IQ score? What you want to put on it? Do you feel like she's genuine in her IQ score? What you want to put on it? I just told you. What you want to put on it? What you want to put on that Kamala had nothing that, that you said Kamala did not handle the Jamal True Love case, right? Well, exactly. Right here it says that. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So while he's doing that, y'all have to stop going just like Google for y'all information. And and it don't make ID no sense. Shown on screen. I was just going to say that. Google, 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 Google just April says. First. Hold on, hold on. Let April go first and then Jasmine. No, to I was going to say, while he's looking that up, the Trey and the, uh, what's, I can't see. I'm sorry. I'm on my phone. Jamisha. Jamisha. Uh -huh. So do you all feel like how Kamala, rep Kamala represents herself, she comes across genuine in the how she does that? I think. Think yes or no? Oh, I'm I'm sorry. I thought you asked me a question. I was going to answer it. I think that's I'm how we start in other in other places with the conversation. I mean, because really, 